Hello. Today's story is John's Easter story from the Archbook series. It's from the Gospel according to John. I'm John. I'm on Patmos, a rocky island, where I wrote about what I saw, touched, and heard. God sent me to tell you of his master's plan and how from the start there was Jesus, the Word. I may be an old man, now grizzled and gray, but once I was younger and busy like you. On the Galilee Sea I fished right night and day, Then Jesus called to me, and to him I flew. Long before this day, now listen as I preach, I followed Jesus as he traveled along. For three years I saw him heal people and teach, that he came to forgive and right what was wrong. It was the first day of the Passover feast, and Peter and I helped prepare for the meal. The twelve of us sat, but before we could eat, Lord Jesus surprised us when we saw him kneel. With a bowl of water and a linen towel, Jesus washed all our feet of filthy road dust. And Peter, the bold one, exclaimed with a howl, Now clean my hands and head, Master, if you must. Except for you, friend, you are, except for your feet, you are clean, Jesus said. I want you to serve and to love as I do. But there is one who eats a bit of my bread, who will kick up trouble for me. This is true. Jesus gave each of us some bread and some wine. He said, here is my body, my blood shed for thee. Remain in in me, friends, just like grapes on a vine, and often do this in remembrance of me. Others did not see the trouble among us, but I leaned near Jesus so I clearly saw. The master dip bread and give it to Judas, who left us so quickly that sneaky outlaw. Then a few hours later, we hid in that room. Gone was our master. Yes, gone was our dear guide. He had gone from us into the darkest gloom. The enemy took him away to be tried. Soldiers had found him in a garden of trees. Torches blazed brightly as Judas kissed his face. They grabbed our Lord. Oh, how I wanted to flee. But I followed the Lord. With them, I kept pace. They dragged Jesus to the church and town leaders. He spoke truth to them all. They just rolled their eyes. He spoke truth to Pilate, who gave in to fears. He faced the crowd, who kept yelling, Crucify! At Jesus' cross, I hugged Mary, his mother. He said, it is finished, and he bowed his head. Then we saw from his side flow blood and water. The worst thing had happened. Our Jesus was dead. We grieved and we mourned. Our dear teacher was gone. They buried him, and we went back to our room. Then on Sunday, Mary arrived just past dawn. She yelled, come, they've taken him out of the tomb.
The others just raced, but Peter, the others just stared, but Peter and I raced. We raced out of the room. We ran right away. We saw the stone rolled from his burial place. This was what we now call the first Easter day. Jesus came, and he blessed us that very night. Receive the Spirit, he told us, and forgive. That Easter I realized God's grace-filled night. Jesus rose, so we'll be forgiven and live. The End